Hey everybody, welcome to Figure Feedback. My name is Jeremy and this is just gonna be a quick video because I just really wanted to show you guys this. I was browsing printables.com and I came across the Mobile Exosuit, which is a phone holder that is designed to look like a mech, like a battle mech. I'll leave a link in the description where you can print this out. It's printed completely out of filament and this thing is just so freaking awesome. So basically, it looks like a mech, but then you can just take your phone and just plop it down right there. And I got this picture of the Iron Giant up here on my phone to sort of just give you a look at what you could do if you decided to print this guy out. But this is a really, really cool piece. And I just want to show you a little bit more about it. Now this, one of the coolest things about this guy is that it's all printed in place. It's in different parts, but you don't need any supports for it. So the pieces that it comes in is this main body piece right here. We also have two arms left in the right arm. We have two legs. We have these little pieces here that holds the bottom of the phone. And then we also have like these two little shoulder pieces right here that uh, the main arm connects to. And then on top of that, you also print out these armor pieces just to sort of complete the set. So we got some shoulder armor, we got this arm armor and some leg, and I guess this will be thigh armor as well. And that just sort of completes the set. Now this is great if you have different color filaments because then you can really make this mech look the way that you want. But since I don't have any fancy color filament at the moment, I just decided to print this all in gray and then I just airbrushed the arms and the body red and then just airbrushed the armor piece is black and I think that it came out pretty darn cool. Here's a look at the back of it. Now as you look at the back you might be able to see some holes or some scratches that I end up putting in this guy because the way that this is supposed to work is that these gears actually turn. You're supposed to be able to just take this and just pull it out and it makes the frame wider so you can put your phone in and then you just push it back together to sort of secure your phone. But the way that this printed on my printer, uh, it doesn't have a big enough of a gap in order for those mechanisms to move. So everything just kind of fused together. So that is a bit of a bummer for me, but it still works out just fine because even though it's not gripping my phone, I can still just put it down and it does what it's supposed to do. It's just holding the phone. I'm not trying to move it around or shake it or anything. It just keeps it upright. And then since his hands have the openings right here, you can slide a charger through the hand and he can just sort of hold on to the charger or you can bring the charger up to the middle to charge your phone while it's still on the base there. And you can still have this really cool mech look. So this shouldn't have a problem fitting the vast majority of phones. This is the Google Pixel 6 and it has a thin case with a pop socket on the back of it. But then I also have this Samsung Galaxy uh, Z Fold 3 with a quad lock attachment on the back. And I can just put this right here too. You know, it just holds it. It's just fine. And since this phone is also one of those phones that just sort of opens up, I can open it and also just put it down here and you know, it just holds it just fine. The time is gonna take you to print all these pieces is definitely gonna depend on the type of printer that you have. But for me, it took the better part of a day with some pieces taking about five to six hours to print and others taking around two or three hours. So it took, uh, I think a few different print jobs in order to get all of the pieces necessary. So yeah, that's how long it took for me on that old uh, Creality Ender 3 Pro. So if you have something newer, something faster, Faster, you can get it done quicker. Yeah, so that's it you guys. I just wanted to show you this cool battle mech. So if you're into stuff like this, you should definitely print it out and give your phone a nice place to hold up. Thank you all so much for watching and until next time, take care of yourselves and I'll talk to you later.